Hi, I'm Ransom Stevens, author of The God Patent. Thanks for your questions. Today, what is the stupidest thing I can do while driving? Well, I don't know if it's the stupidest possible thing, but tailgating in a certain position turns out to be both really stupid and quite common. If it takes between a quarter and half a second to close the gap between you and the car in front of you, you're driving in the dumbest possible place. Here's why. Human reaction time is a quarter of a second. That's if you're expecting the cue. If you're not expecting it, then you have to add almost another quarter of a second. So if the car in front of you jumps on the brakes and you're between a quarter and a half a second behind, you won't have time to touch the brakes before impact. Now, in the extremes, obviously if you're way behind exercising the two second rule, you'll have plenty of time to respond as the car in front of you hits the brake and slows down, no impact. At the opposite extreme, if you are tailgating right on the other car's bumper, then when he hits the brakes, there's no impact because you have no relative speed. It's just as if he's towing you and he brakes for you. The problem comes when you're at this critical point where he's had the most time possible to hit the brakes before you've gotten a chance to touch them. That's when you will have the maximum possible impact, and that's right between a quarter and half a second, say three-eighths of a second. So the answer is, at 60 miles an hour, the stupidest distance to tailgate is between one and a half and two car lengths. You and they are better off if you're closer than that. Please post your questions at Facebook, YouTube, or send me an email. Thank you very much. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to step on your tail. Stepped on his tail. Hi, I'm Ransom Stevens, author of The God Patent.